Here we go. Amber, holiday gatherings can sometimes be a little bit awkward, but you had a particularly <laughs> uncomfortable Christmas once. What happened? Yes, um, the first year that my husband and I were dating, mm -hmm. we flew back to Ontario to stay at his parents' ranch for Christmas. His ex-girlfriend was living with his parents at the time, and we had brought along our new shepherd puppy, and not only did the puppy have a large poop in the girlfriend's room, she also proceeded to eat all of the girlfriend's Christmas chocolate, and then reintroduce it on the bed sheets. Oh! Yeah. Okay. Now after each one of Amber's stories, one of you will get to ask a question to help you determine if she's telling the truth or if she's lying. Anthony, you take the first question. Okay. How long had your, uh, your husband and his ex been broken up for at this point? Uh, about a year. All right. So now it's decision time. Was that story true? Was it false? Here and at home, make your choice. Amber's first story was about a very awkward Christmas. Did you think it was true or false? Half true, half false. <laughs> the lie detector and its hunky operator say that story was true. Richard and Maya. Richard, what was it about the way Amber told that story that made you think it was true? Well, I saw her eyes light up when she mentioned her new husband and also when she mentioned her dog, so I thought that had to be true. That's good. Your husband will want to know that your eyes light up when you speak about him. <laughs>